Good enough. Thank you. Like <laughs> and subscribe. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Welcome to your channel. Them zombie chickens really are zombie chickens because they was eating the turkey. They was literally eating the turkey. So this turned into a cage that was gonna put something else in to a hospital warden for the half eat turkey. And today we're gonna try to we're gonna try to finish this cage today. All we like is putting the metal on the back side and a little bit of wire on this door right here. While it's good and cloudy and it ain't so bad hot, so We'll get that knocked out, that way we'll get some chickens in here.
left the rest of the metal on. But as you can see, we got rained out. That's absolutely coming from it. I'll do the now to fill in the around the bottom before we dug out. We're gonna put the shavings down here too. Make it real thick. But I mean as you can actually put the chickens in here right now. Minus the feeding and the water is all put those in here. We can actually put them in here right now. But we're not going to, I gotta uh, there's a couple of places I gotta put wire up, we'll do that in this video too. There's a couple more sections we've got to put wire up. But other than that, we can work inside, we ain't gonna be in the race. I don't know if you can hear that on the camera or not. Show my runoff on that roof. That's how much water we're losing right now, but it comes to the roof. Say 21 by 29. Oh, why is my sleeping on So if I might let it lap over there, that way it kind of covers it with crack. Mm -hmm. Just have to be careful with it whenever you open it and not get cut with it or something. When people start getting cut with it, I'll cut it off, but for right now, I'll leave it on there. Right. That covers it good. You just have to remember it's on there when you go this way. Okay guys, we're trying to hurry and get this cage done. We come out this morning and our zombie chickens 
and our other turkeys were hurting this turkey. So we wanted to hurry and get this cage done and get him by himself so he can heal and get some medicine and stuff and put on him. Yeah, we've, already, we've already sprayed medicine on him. So I guess they really are zombie chickens because mm -hmm. they're eating that one. Mm-hmm. We got this here at Tractor Supply. It's Heal XL Wound and Skin Care. And we're going to spray it on him a couple, two or three times a day until he gets better. We got one of the water totes out of the other one and put it out here for him. And then also a feeder. This is, we just filled this up with fresh water here. Okay. I replaced the nipples on it. I went ahead and done that. Look, they're trying to figure out what he's doing. There's the other turkey right there. One of the other turkey. There you go, turkey. Here they come. Huh. I said here they start coming out. Oh, that's tough to get them. Oh yeah. That was a bunch of big in that one. Yeah. All right, that's uh, pretty much gonna do it for this little cage right here. We got all the ends boxed in. I put that piece of wire like right there, a little tiny corner right there. Cause up here on this mountain, you gotta enclose everything big enough for anything to get in. Cause it's, you know, a raccoon or something, they'll squeeze right in something and kill everything, every chicken you got. So I'm trying to make sure that everything's boxed in or covered with some wire or something. And we're using this half inch uh, hardware cloth on everything. And then we have the predator aprons. I mean, that's about the best we can do as far as you know, predators, I guess. Well, I mean, there's other things we can do, but that's about the best we can do for right now. But, I mean, that's it. We got the water. Had to, re had to change the, the nipples out on it. Uh, brought one of the feeders over here out of the other cage. I put 100 pounds of corn in it to hold him for a few days till it gets better. He already looks better after I sprayed that mess on him. Mm -hmm. So, them zombie chickens really are zombie chickens because they was eating the turkey. They was literally eating the turkey. So. My poor turkey. Yeah. What it is in a chicken, if, uh, a chicken is like attracted to red, real bright red or whatever, like blood or anything like that. And if they ever see it, they'll stay, they'll keep on it and on it and on it until they actually kill the chicken or whatever. But uh, if they see blood, they'll continue to get him. That's the reason you gotta, you know, put him by himself. Isolate him, the one that's hurt. So this turned into a cage that was going to put something else in to a hospital ward for the half eat turkey so anyway guys if you haven't done so yet please hit that like and subscribe button you know it don't cost you anything to do and uh, helps out a little bit but anyway we'll catch you on the next one I'm watching there you go good job